It was the evening before our final day of recording. We were out relaxing and enjoying some food when we start discussing Elgar's In Smyrna. How had we not considered this piece for the disc? It fitted the concept beautifully. We decided it was simply too good to leave out, and if things went well the following day, we might just have time to arrange and record it. Elgar's original version for piano was swiftly found, Dorico booted up, and before we knew it, we had an arrangement. Dorico made this process ever so simple. It's intuitive, everything is where you'd want it to be, and the shortcuts and popovers allow you to access and input huge amounts of detail remarkably quickly. The following day, we decided to jump straight into our new arrangement, after just a few bars, we knew we had made the right decision, and within half an hour, we had ironed out any problems and found colours I'm sure Elgar himself would have been proud of. In Smyrna, it was a great addition to the disc. To be able to pull it together so late in the day is remarkable, really, and credit must go to Dorico for ensuring the writing process never got in the way of what we were trying to achieve.